One of the most important things that I've learned along the way is the value of time. I want to challenge you to really think how you will spend your time. We live in a society that will ask you to put out maximum results in minimum time. We replace face-to-face -face encounters with texting and Facebook. We replace in-depth conversations with short tweets and posts. We spend less time with our family and friends. Now, I used to think that success in life and relationships was about talent, but I've discovered that it's really about time. With time, you can learn to do anything, and you can build trust with anybody, but you really have to put the effort in. There's no app for good relationships. Someone told me once that People don't care how much you know until they know how much you care. We have to earn people's respect by showing them that we care. Think about your time as an investment. It's not something to be simply wasted, but something that will yield results depending on how you use it. It's valuable, and when used to enrich the lives of others, the return will be incredible. Don't just spend time with your friends, invest time with them. Nothing beats your undistracted attention into someone else's life to break through the surface and really get to know them. Wherever you are, be all there. It's okay to be doing just one thing at a time and to concentrate on just the people who are in the room with you. Despite what it seems, everyone still has the same amount of hours in a day as they did in years past. But we continually find more ways to use our time while trying to find more ways to save it. You see, you can't actually save time. You can just find different ways to spend it. We need time to think, to be alone, to dream. So step back and think about what you really don't want to lose. Because opportunities will come and go but some relationships will last a lifetime.